Just off of Route 1 in the beautiful coastal town of York, Maine, lies the old burying yard. Encased by a small stone wall, this old burying yard contains many old graves of residents of the town's distant past. One of the more notorious graves in this cemetery is that of Mary Nason, also known as the Witch's Grave. Miss Nason's grave is unique due to the many stones on it. A headstone, a footstone, and a heavy stone slab between them covering the ground over her body. The legend is that the stones is to keep her in the grave, typical of a witch's grave. Whatever the reason for the slab, it is notable as the only grave of its kind in the cemetery. Reported to be haunting the cemetery, Mary Mason had been a respected herbalist in the town of York and was also skilled at performing exorcisms. Dying at the tender age of 29, her portrait is represented atop of the headstone. The graves in the old York burying yard cover the year 1705 through the 1850s, and it is rumored that victims of a brutal Indian attack, known as the Candlemas Day Massacre, are also buried in the cemetery in unmarked graves. Many headstones in the old York burying yard present attitudes and half-told stories which suspect lives cut short and reasons to suspect that spirits still linger at the graves 